Hello children, Namaste everyone. Welcome back to the Mathematics class. Dear children, in our last uh, class we have seen about uh, factors and multiples and some tests of divisibility. So how we can recognize or identify a number which is divisible by 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8, uh, 9, 10, 11 like that. So that is what we have seen in our last videos. Today we will see one important topic about prime factorization, highest common factor and least common multiple. About this we will see. See before that uh, we have studied about prime numbers and composite numbers, prime numbers and composite numbers. So what are these prime numbers? and composite numbers. Prime number, a number which is divisible by 1 and that number itself is called prime number. No other factor, a number which has 1 is the factor and that number is also one factor. So except that go, if any other factor are there, there, such a number is called composite number. That is what we have seen in our last class, is it? Now, Co-prime number, what are co-prime number? Co-prime number. See, what are co-prime numbers? See, for example, if a number has no common factors except one, one is the factor of all numbers, is it? One is the factor of all numbers. If you take any two numbers, say 4 and 20, which are the factors of 4? 1, 2, 4 are the factors. Which are the factors of 20 or 25, say 25? Which are the factors of 25? 1, uh, 5, or 25. These are the factors of 25. So, 1, 5, 25 are the factors of 25. 1, 2 and 4 are the factors of 25. In that, 1 is a common factor. No other factors are common. Is it? Therefore, 1 is a common factor for 4 and 25. If 2 numbers or more than 2 numbers having 1 as the common factor then that numbers are called co-prime factors. See 4 and 25 have 1 as a common factor. No other factor is common here. See the factor of 4 is 1, 2 and 4. Is it? Factor of factors of 25 are 1, uh, 5 and 25. Here 1 is a common factor to both the numbers. If 1 is a factor, then that numbers are called co-prime numbers. Remember this. Okay. So what are co-prime numbers? If two numbers or more, two or more numbers having 1 as a common factor, they are called a common co-prime factor. Now, prime factorization. What is this prime factorization? See, let us take one example, 36. Look at this 36. Eh? We have studied in our last class about prime numbers. So which are the prime numbers? 2 is the least prime number. 2 is the least prime number. Then if 3, 4 is not a prime number. Then 5, 6 is not a prime number. Then 7, 8 is not a prime number because it is divided by 2, 4, etc. Then 9 is also not a prime number because 9 can be divided by 3 also. Then 10 is not. Then 11, 13. These are all the prime numbers. See, these are all the prime numbers. 2, 3, 5, 7, 11. 13, then 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, next prime number is 17, nice. So these are the prime numbers we have seen. See, you have to go on divide by that, uh, that given number by these prime numbers. Least, you have started from least prime number. See, 36 can be divided by 18, not like that. So you have to go for 2. If it is not possible by 2, you have to go for 3. If it is not possible by 3, you have to go for 5. Like that. By 2, if you divide by 2, 36 can be divided by 2 80 times, so completely, so 2 80 in the 36. Again divided by 2, what happens? 8, 8, 18 can be divided by 2 9 times. 8, 9 the uh, 2, so 80 can be divided by two, uh, 9 times by 2. So 2 9 the 18, then 9. Again divide by 2, is it possible? So by 2, you can't divide 9 by 2 completely. So you have to go for next prime number, that is 3. Whether it is possible by 3, let us see. 3 is 
3, 3 is our 9. So, 9 can be divided by 3, by 3 times, so 3, 3 is our 9. No reminder here, is it? You can divide it by 3. Then, 3 is the least prime number, so we are finished. That division is finished. Therefore, 36 means 2 into 2 into 3 into 3. 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 is equal to 36. See, 2 2s are 4, 4 3s are 12, 12 3s are 36. We can write like this. Therefore, these are the prime factors of 36. This is this procedure is called prime factorization. So, prime factorization. What you have to do? You have to how to find the five prime factors? Sir? See, two, three are the prime factors, is it? So, two into two into three into three are the prime factors of thirty-six. Okay. So, in, uh, simply you can write like this: two how many times? Two times. Two to the power two. Into three how many times? It is also uh, two times. You can write like this also. 2 into 2 as 2 to the power 2, 2 times, 2 square, 3 into 3 as 3 to the power 2, you can write by this. So, this is the prime factors of 36. In the same way, another number I will write, 980, suppose 980, which are the prime factors of 980, you can divide it by 2, how you know, uh, how whether it is possible by 2, you know, how what is the condition to whether number is divisible by 2 if 0, 2, 4, 6 or 8 are the unit place that number is divisible by 2 so you can divide it by 2 so divide it by 2 2 4s are 8 here 9 are there 1 carries here so 18 becomes 18 2 9s are 18 and 1 0 is there so 490 2 4 again you can divide by 2 2 2s are 4 2 4s are 8 1 reminder 10, 2 5s are 10. So, is it possible to divide it by 2? Can't because 5 is there in the denominator. So, you can't divide it by 2. So, whether it is possible, next number what you have to go? You have to go for 3. Whether it is divisible by 3 possible completely? 3, 8s are 24 and 5. You can't divide 2 1s are 2 and remains here. So, you can't divide it by 2, 3 completely. So, you can't. Then you have to go for 5. Yes, let us go for 5. 5, 4s are 20. 24 are there. It becomes 45. 5, 9 are 45. Again, is it possible to divide by 5? You can't. 9 is there in the unit place. You can't. Then, where you have to go? You have to go for 7. 7, 7s are 49. 7 is the least prime number. So, you can't divide. That, that division finished here. So, which are the factors of 80? 980. 980 means 2 into 2 into 5 into 7 into 7. So, 2 into 2 into 5 into 7 into 7 means 980. So, this is called prime factors of 980. So, simply you can write like this also. 2 to the power 2 into 5 to the power 1, 1 5. So, 7 to the power 2. So, 2 to the power 2 into 5 to the power 1, only really 1, 5. Then, into 7 to the power 2, 2, 7 are there. Like this also you can write. So, these are the prime factors of 980. So, to write the prime factors, what you have to do? You have to go on dividing this number by the least prime numbers. Okay. So, this is the way to find the prime factors of a particular number. Okay. Uh, like this, you have to see. So, this is about the prime factorization. Okay. Yes. Uh, so, this is about the co prime numbers and prime factorization. How to find the prime factors of a given number. Okay. Uh, let us see uh, something about uh, uh, LCM and HCF in our another video. See you in our next video. Thank you.